Now just to prove to you I am a woman of my word, I thought I'd show you. I've just had a shower and let me tell you how much better I feel. It's so good to have a shower when you don't have to. When you're in the moment and you're feeling that water oh, and the warmth is just trickling. It's nothing like it. I love it. I love it. So the next phase of my pampering is I've got my mask on. I've got my not tested on animals mask on because it is absolutely bloody ridiculous that we're still testing on animals in this day and age for Christ's sake. We know what works and what doesn't by now. <sighs> um, so I have my animal friendly mask on. I have my pieces of cucumber which will be going over my eyes. As I lay back and relax with my little massager thing, I know that looks a bit uh, rude, but it's not. <laughs> um, it's though you plug it in, it's got those ball things that like rub up and down your back. It's pretty awesome. Uh, and while that's happening, after I've had my little rest with my cucumbers, I'm of course going to have a cup of tea. I'll see you shortly. Oh, and I forgot to tell you, while I'm doing all this, I will be sitting back relaxing and watching a DVD uh, recommended to me by my sister-in-law. She swears by it, reckons it's amazing, great. Um, I'm just hoping it's not too depressing. But we'll see. How is there, is there a more relaxing sound than Earl Grey being poured into a cup? I think not. Okay, so I have my little massage, I have my cucumber on my eyes, and they feel really nice and sort of open now and good, and I've taken my mask off, I feel very relaxed, and now I'm just going to do a honey mask, which you will find in any kitchen, you just grab some honey, heat it up, not too hot, because you'll scald yourself in the microwave for, I don't know, I'll check it out now, but it's probably about 5 to 10 seconds. Put that on your face and it is really good for your skin and very, very nourishing. And just when I remember, uh, while I remember, uh, guys out there, this is not just for girls. This is not just for women. You guys should be nurturing yourselves as well. And nobody's around. Nobody's going to know that you put honey on your face or cucumber or you watched P.S. I love you. Just do it. Okay, just putting a bit of honey in a cup. That's uh, probably enough. Oh, probably more than enough. All right. Pop in the microwave. Okay, so you want it to be runny like that, but just make sure with your finger first that it's not too hot before you put it on your face. Okay, that's that's a little bit hot, but it's fine. Okay, so then when you've got it, when you've got the honey, you just take it out, put it on. That's all. Might feel a bit sticky or whatever, but it is honey. And the best thing about it is you can eat it. Yum. I love honey. Okay, now just a reminder, when you put your honey mask on, uh, don't put it on the sensitive bit under your eye there or on your eyelid, but just all around the rest of the face is fine. It's very, very nourishing and very, very good for you and very, very natural. Now I get to sit back, relax and watch my movie, P.S. I Love You. Uh, I'll let you know how it goes and have my cup of tea. Just relax and I've still got my mask on but because it's not some chemical crap, you can leave it on pretty much as long as you want. No pressure. That's what I like to see. Well, I don't know how good the light is here but... Um, so I don't know if you can see my skin and if there's any difference or whatever, but I feel there's a difference. It's a lot smoother. It's, it's sort of glowing in that. It feels, it feels so good. It feels awesome. And that's just honey. So I just washed that off with a bit of sorbeline and uh, yeah, it comes off really easy. <sighs> well... I've had my night of pampering and um, I just finished watching P.S. I Love You which was part of my pamper night or whatever. Gee, thanks for that Jess because I've just been uh, crying on and off for um, however long the movie is. Very touching. 
Um, and it really makes you think, you know, about really showing the people that you love how much you love them. Because you never know when they're going to be taken away. And it's, um, yeah, it's a good movie. So if you get a chance, check it out. Okay, I think, um, might be time for a tea in a lamington after that. And, um, till next time, keep shining your light.